All right, we're back solving the wonderful world of wine. Uh, we've been solving professions. We are solving the people in the wine world, so we're solving a cooper. Um, okay. So, oh yeah, we were in the process of putting the word wood in front of barrels and c commenting the obvious. So wood equals 57, 57, barrels is 75. Like, the digits are the same, they reverse. So wood barrels is obvious, divides by three. Um, let's just get it on the, and wood drums. And then metal divides by three, so, you know, you can go like this. So, uh, wood barrels, chain links bookends, wood drums, bookends, three, same number obviously, one, three, two, metal drums, 126, and then metal barrels, same and then uh, stick the word wine in there. So, wood, wine, barrels, you get the idea. That equals Christ the Redeemer. Wood, wine, barrels, letters and strokes divided by three, wood, wine, drums. Oh, that's stunning. Just stunning. Stunning. Amazing. Okay. Mise en rose. Well, that's beautiful. Yeah, that's easy. Assembly divides by three. So assembly of a barrel divides by three. So the assembly of a barrel equals 207. There you go. What else are we going to find in Cooperville? I believe there's a place on Earth called Cooperville. It's a very famous last name because, you know, Cooperville. Ville divides by three. Okay, so Cooper. Anything else here? Are you got to be kidding me? Well, that's a huge cool gem. That is a huge cool gem. Incidentally, I gotta, I gotta put this all on screen for you. Let's just shave it right down to the screen length so your screen size here so not missing a detail what it is we've got on this web browser so look at this this is an obvious gem for the number three. Oh man like look at how obvious this is it's pure nines oh man and add z a z equals 27 d equals 9 good night for love that is just too obvious in 12 strokes man and then when you say and, that divides by three. So when and, it divides by three. Wow. Chain linked and bookended, no less. And add, z in six letters, 18 strokes, threes, and add, z. This is going slightly back in time. And add, z is an ancient type of edge tool. Well, edge tools, plural, divides by three. Of course, the word ancient divides by three. Edge tool, amazingly singular or plural, glorifies three. So you can say, this, this will all divide by three. <laughs> so this whole first sentence divides by three, minus the alternative spelling. Actually, no, even with the alternative spelling. <laughs> but <laughs> ready for some serious truth here, kids? Ready to see how an adze is an ancient type of edge tool. Uh, that's the 330 perfectly. Yay. dating back to the Stone Age. Oh, an axe, of course. Well, look at the obviousness between adze and axe. Oh, man. The center letters make 24 and 30, respectively, adding to love, and then the bookends make 6. So this is 30 and this is 36. Threes. And of course, they're shaped like threes, so they divide things because they're shaped like triangles in order to have a blade. Edge divides by three, blade divides by three, razor divides by three. And so a hand adsy, threes, the hand adsy, threes. Handle divides by three. Blade. Wow, blade divides by 12 just like adsy. 
So the blade of an adze all divides beautifully by three. And then the blade of an axe will obviously divide by three, <laughs> being one, two, three. That's real cool. Whenever something equals one, two, three, it's pretty darn awesome. The blade of an axe equals one, two, three. Or an axe blade will divide by three. What would an axe blade? An axe blade. Oops. That equals Jehovah. Sweet. And I'm going to start a new video soon because I do not want this crash. Even the word shaft divides by three. Shaft equals love. Adzies. Ah. Hmm. I mean, look at the three components. One, two, three. And then, of course, the tip is triangular. Sure. For his wah, well, that's 24 triple eight. <laughs> With an ad. See, that's a cool photo. I like that. Taking us back. I'm just going to go into the Okay, I'm already happy. Ah, there's the Cooper's ad see right there for the barrels. Okay, I'm we want to stay close to Wineland here. But you can see the obvious threes, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And of course the tip is a triangle, one, two, three. It's like when are people going to wake up and realize this story belongs to the Triune God? And of course the word hand is three times three. That's so cool that it's Adzi. Like, you've got to be kidding me. Like, that's the official name in the story of God. Like, it's got an A plus a Z. That's King, 27. <laughs> Followed by an a D and E, which is another 9. It's like, you got to be kidding me. And they're interlocked for maximum intimacy. And you get bookending that way. And, like, these guys make 30 in the center, which equals Axe. You're just like... It's a three heaven, folks. Like, it's literally, and the number of strokes divides by three. It's 12 strokes and four letters. That means the average letter has three strokes. Three for an A, three for a Z, two for a D, four for an E. It's like, talk about a simple, concise word that glorifies the number three. I marvel at some of the simplest things are the most mathematically stunning. Oh, they're made of wood. Oh, rope equals love. It's just like, the first three letters of stone equals love, S-T-O. You're just like, how much more is God going to make this too obvious for himself? And by the way, those people were happy back then, just like we are now. Like, God just ordained them to have the grace to be as happy as we are today. Like, there's no more happiness today than there was 4,000 years ago. There really isn't. <laughs> people had God if they did confess God. And they had, you know. Cool. All right, stay tuned. Oh, a wah. Okay, I'm going to start a new video.